I'm not sure if I'm ever going to read what I'm about to write, but what I do know is that it needs saying. You see, there's this girl named Christine, and I saw her today for the first time in four days, and I think it's time I tell her about the feelings I have for her. She picked me up from my house today to go to the beach, and I tried to tell her this in the moment, but I got too embarrassed. Hey, you, uh, <clears throat> your hair looks nice. <laughs> Thanks, just trying to make it look better than yours. I'm kidding, I'm, I'm, I'm kidding. <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> You see, it's a funny situation I'm in. She's dating my friend Jeremy. The three of us have been close since early elementary school, and I've never really had a problem with them being together. Anyways, I was worried about how to start the conversation, making sure how to say the right thing and all. Wait, why are we pulling over? Jeremy really wanted to hang out today. Great. Yo! Yo! What a do, what a do, how goes it, babe? Hi. Yeah, how we done, how we hey. done? Hey. Beach day! Wow! Oh, yeah. Uh, Jeremy, I thought you were going to the gym today. What happened? Oh, Nana needed me to feed the ferret, so got in the morning pump. That's for Jeremy. All right. Wow! What is wrong with you more than the last one? Hey, are you okay? Oh, shoot. This is my fault. She's totally angry at me. This is because. She's been driving me around all day, and I didn't even offer to pay for gas money. I didn't even say anything. It's Please. Jeremy. I think I'm gonna break up with him. That was the turning point of the day. Like, I did not see that coming. At all. Does this mean I have a chance? Look, man, it's gonna be okay. I'm here for you. <laughs> I'm so sorry you have to go through this. This must be terrible. This is the greatest day of my life. Although I, I do feel guilty for saying that. Yeah. How far do you think I can throw this pine cone? Are you even listening to me? Yes, yeah, no, of course. It's just scary to me. Jeremy and I fight just like my parents fought. Mm. Yeah. I just don't want to be anything like them. I'm just tired of listening to it, you know? I just want to do everything I can to have a completely different relationship than them. I can't really put into words how she makes me feel. She's so caring and compassionate. I just don't know how to tell her. Oh my God, I swear. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna have to tell her. I'm gonna have to be very vulnerable. I'm gonna have to be very, very vulnerable. What was that? Oh, shoot. Did I just say that last part out loud? Uh, yeah, you said something about being vulnerable? Hey, um, I, I actually have to go <laughs> grab something. Oh, wait, wait, but there's something I just wanted to tell you first. Yeah, okay. sure, what's up? Um, well, I've known you for a long time, we're pretty close, so I feel like I can tell you something kind of personal. Um, it's been something I've been thinking about for a really long time. Ever since Jeremy and I broke up. Yeah, of course. I think I like girls. <laughs> uh. 
I'm so torn. I want to be there to support her, of, of course. It just... It wasn't that that affected me most. At the end, she told me... I'm just so glad I can trust you. You'll always be my friend. Yeah, she probably told me maybe like two weeks after we broke up. Good for her though, you know? Shaping herself into the woman she truly wants to be. It is what it is though. Bro. I love her. Wait, what? I love her, man. She made me feel things I never felt before. Wait, wait. The hell you mean by that? Nah, man, nah. Do you know how disrespectful that shit is? Are you kidding me? You are wild with the audacity of this guy. It's gonna take me some time to heal. But I'm starting to realize that all I've ever wanted is to see both of us happy. And I am. Just seeing her smile. <laughs>